I'm Dave Dentinger. I'm a physical therapist at the Aurora Sports Medicine Institute. I'm here today with Carolyn Destash, who's a personal trainer at the Jewish Community Center in Milwaukee. Today we're going to go through a series of some strengthening and balance exercises, which are designed primarily for, older po for an older population, but are appropriate for people of all ages. First of all, we're going to sample a couple of the exercises. The first exercise we're going to do today is a very simple just sit to stand maneuver. What I'm going to, it's very easy to do at home. What I'd like you to do, Carolyn, is go ahead and tighten your abdominals. So draw your stomach in just a little bit. Okay, arms forward and lean forward a little bit and come up nice and slow and under control. Okay, and then slowly back down. And there you go. Now, if you have any problems with this exercise, any pain, uh, difficulty holding good form, it's very important that you do this under control. Uh, there's a couple simple modifications that you can do. The first one is if there's arms on the chair, you can just use the assistance of the arms as you come up. Okay. If there's no arms on the chair, you can just rest your hands right on your thighs and come on up as well. A lot of people may still have problems with this one because of weakness. So what you can do is just bring your feet underneath you a little bit more and come on up. So it'll just make it a little bit easier. But the most important thing with this exercise is that there's no pain. And then second of all, you want to make sure that you have good form. Another exercise you'll see is a really, relatively simple maneuver that you can do. For this exercise, which is for both strength and balance, what I'm going to have Carolyn do is just use the back of the chair for a little bit of finger support. And from here, I'm going to have her go up on her toes and down, and then rocking back on her heels. So it's a very simple thing that you can do for both strength and balance. You may feel a number of muscles working as you do it, but primarily it's designed to work the muscles in the front and the back of the lower leg. Okay. Strength and balance exercises are important for a couple different reasons. Number one is they are very important for injury prevention. And second of all, they will help with just your ability to perform normal daily activities. The heel-toe balance walk. It's great for balance. You need to find a spot that's nice and flat and you want to be able to concentrate because it's a difficult exercise because you're not hanging on to anything. So the exercise starts by just walking, but you're placing your heel right in front of your toe. Arms go out to the side for extra balance, and just walking heel, toe, heel, toe. As you get better, you can drop the hands and try and do it heel, toe, heel, toe. Also, finding an object to stare at will help your balance as well. 